subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! Well, what's up guys? It's Tom Stoltman here, Wild Straws Man 2021 with another episode of Spicy Stoltman's. And today, we are at a special location. We are here, London, the hot floor and had a hotel. The day before, Albert Hall, Giants Live. 18 months with no fans, finally we get fans back in, finally we get to put on a show for the fans. Done a lot of media today, we're just gonna chill. Athlete meeting soon, so. Looks feeling really good, I'm feeling really good. We will soon see you later. It's Tom Stoltman here again, with another episode of Rotator Cuffs and Wrist Curls. So guys, we are here in the hotel, been here for a day or so, chilling around London, went to Parliament today <laughs> with the Queen. How was it? Very good. Uh, got treated like a king in there. Everybody kind of blown away that I was World Straw's man and was like privileged to meet me, so that was really cool. But yeah, fight you to the Parliament. So we're going to be going to the half week meeting, going to see all the guys, going to see Bibby, going to see Paul Dwyer, going to see Gav Billiton and the rest. <laughs> half week meeting, go through the rules. You'll see it on the camera, I think, anyway, and see what the crack is for tomorrow. We will know more as soon as that's done. So as soon as that's done, we'll jump back on camera and tell you all about Britain's Got Talent here at Albert Hall. So what are you doing here? This what week? am I doing here? Yeah, I am. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm shooting a documentary, um, so obviously the documentary's coming to an end, guys. Go follow the documentary page. Sorry, I'm plugging on your channel. Yeah, stop but, um, the documentary, the documentary uh, big, big deal. I'm just here to watch these guys compete as well. It's really fun. Everyone's asking when the documentary is going to be done. Do we have a rough timeline? Okay, we're looking early 2022. Early 2022. It'll, be, it'll definitely be after World's Strongest Man 2020. Once I win again. One. Just been speaking to little Joe there about the predictions for the Royal Albert Hall. My predictions are I'm going to win every single event and that's all that matters. Bye Joe! On all seriousness guys, let's be serious. I think Tom will do well if he wants to. Adam Bishop will do really well. Novikov will do really well. Iron Bibby will hopefully get the actual Queen and Press record. Mark Felix will hopefully get the Hercules hold. My prediction is I end up in the crowd very, very drunk. How do you think you're going to do Tom? I'm going to win. I'm the <laughs> champ. Event one for event two, event three, event four, event five. Thank you for coming, guys. Yeah, I'll do all right. Um, <laughs> I've had a lot of media, so body feels all right. I'm just going to go and have some fun, enjoy the crowd, soak it all up. Been a long 18 months with no strongman fans here, so yeah. Just have fun with everybody else and let's see what happens. Are you excited for the competition tomorrow? I'm buzzing, yeah, I'm really excited, yeah. Are you so, bringing anyone in tomorrow? We are bringing somebody. Somebody is a, probably Tom's biggest fan. Um, Tom doesn't know it yet. It's my little sister, Neve, is coming along. And she doesn't know we just got tickets for her as well, so. I sorted you out some tickets. Don't you want anything for the best support in the world? I might even give you a signed t-shirt. Could everyone shut up? Tom wants to speak. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. I dance here. <laughs> Would you dance if I asked you to dance? Would you run and definitely not look back? Now would you fart when we get our feet you right? together? Would you let me drop it in your mouth? Tom Stroman, strongest man on earth. I got pastas, I think the pasta and yeah. uh, potatoes and chips. Can you do your best uh, Conor McGregor impression? Okay. <laughs> I'm going to. I want to apologise to absolutely effing nobody. Folks, thank you very much from Daz and I for coming along and supporting this one. It's not exactly been an easy one. Uh, to say the least. Uh, lucky, of course, we had bad weather this week to you know get people to go indoors. There's a lot of people coming anyway. Yeah, it, it's it's gonna feel pretty packed in there. Well, it is small. The area is small. It's like an old sort of Shakespearean stage. Basically. I'm just incredibly grateful that everybody's here. I think it's a wonderful uh, thing that so many great guys have backed this. You know, we've got for one night only. We've got big laws. Until next week, obviously. Um, <laughs> yeah. 
Has anyone seen this guy on telly? Jerome's strongest man! In the house! Right here! And he's stole it off this man! Jerome's strongest man! Right here! What a lineup! Have a lot of fun. Who knows whether I'll ever get back in again. It's just about the grandest arena there is in the 150th year since it was built. The athletes will be picked up at 1 o'clock tomorrow from here. Friends and family are going to go to um, the box office, is that right, Linz? And pick your tickets up. You're going to be close to the athletes, you can see them all, and it's sort of, it's not back of stage, it's a choir seat, so it's at the back. But it'll just be athletes, but you can get to your partners and stuff like that if you need things, or any help or anything like that. So we're kicking off with uh, axle press maximum. So we're starting with 170 kilos, and then we're going to go 190, 205, and then straight for a world record, so just four lifts. So, has anybody got any questions on, on that? Is anybody happy or not happy? There's obviously with the axle, there's, there is a lot of, a lot, especially when you look online, there's a lot of questions of what's allowed and what's not. I would say this if you're going to, I mean, me, 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 if you're going to do a belt clean, right, I think it needs to go higher. If it goes down onto it, but you can't go straight from the belt up. But if you think you are going to use your belt, turn it round. Do you know what I mean? You've got to you know, turn it round and have it tight at the back and then you can't be accused of doing a belt clean. I think that's a fair, yeah. fair thing to say. Don't just lean yeah, it there. Yeah, have this way, set on it and then straight up. If it drops onto it, you know... So, so just don't do it. Just don't do it, yeah. <laughs> so the second event's Hercules Hall. I think Roy's got most of you guys done it before, so we've kept all your old uh, setups. Has anybody not done it before? Par, have you done it, Hercules Hall? Yeah. No. Right, okay. Well, if anybody wants to read... Right. Oh. right, okay, we'll set it up for you. So go, if you go see Roy, we'll set up on the stage. Okay. Everybody else, if, you, if you're not happy with how it's been set up before, go see Roy, but he's got all your old set up. You know, everything's coded, so we just can't have it. Because it's dangerous. The second thing is... Pa, do you want to come up and talk, or do you want me to do it? <laughs> <laughs> On the TV is not the official clock. Listen to me, not the clock, because that's just you know a bit rough. The next event we're going to do deadlift. It's the uh, 360 uh, axles that we've always used. Um, again, a lot of them used them before. If you haven't used them, just be aware that when you drop them down, if you drop them down too hard, they do move a lot, move around a little bit. Uh, so don't, don't drop them down too hard. I think the world record on that, Neo, was it's eight, is it? Who's that? Is that Alice? Right. Just, just make sure, guys, that you wait for your down signals. If you're not getting a down signal, that means you haven't fully locked out to something, right? But as soon as you get the down signal, you can put it down. So the next event is frame walk. It's 20 meters. We've done it the same way as before. So it's approximately 400 kilos. Bish has got the world record on that, I think. Bish. So Bish. Which is point three. There we go. And I mean normal, normal straps. Normal straps, yeah. And, and if you want my advice, just stagger them a little bit so it doesn't it doesn't tip forward. You know. Through the hoops and all. You can do what you want. Oh, yeah. Anything, you, anything you want, yeah. Any straps? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then the stones. And then it's a lighter set of stones because some of you guys know a couple of injuries and just got back from worlds and stuff. So we'll put the lighter set in there. Up to 120. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's it, I think. Uh, right, yeah. That's pretty much it, Maggie. Yeah. Dave, Dave, Maggie, anyone? Yeah. Other dad? I, no. I want to wish you all a good contest, have fun, and don't get injured. <laughs> <laughs> Break a leg. Yeah. Break a leg as they say. Do the, the following train just make their own way down to the show? Yeah. 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 Okay. I mean, it, 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 is, it is incredibly walkable. Yeah. I would say it's on a nice day, it might be. We're not walking, right? No, no you guys are getting picked up. <laughs> <laughs> We've got golf carts once you're inside as well. <laughs> can I just, um, can, can we just have Mr. Iron Bibby up here for one second and Mr. Quinn here? Get the cameras rolling, baby. Get ready for Guinness, the first Guinness World Record of the weekend. Can you come here, please? <laughs> the best ring of the bicep. Oh, 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 yeah, baby. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. I believe the world record is 26 inches. <laughs> Look at this! 
video on YouTube. Boom! <laughs> right guys, so just a quick reminder, we have the two world's strongest men yes. in the same here. place. And very kindly, Alexi has agreed to come up to the Highlands of Scotland. Three <laughs> world's <laughs> And well, uh, there's three strongest men in the world here. And, and then there's me. <laughs> but um, yeah, so Alexi's going to come up. We've got an evening with on this Wednesday coming um, in Ness walks in Inverness. Five star event, it's sold out so you can't come but Simon's going to film it all, we're going to do some stuff, get Alexi swimming in Loch Ness. It'll be good fun. So stay tuned for that. You excited? Yeah. That is the rule meeting done the day before us and now the night before uh, Giants Live, Royal Albert Hall. Super excited. Everyone's looking good. Iron Bibby just got his biceps measured. 28 points. Insane, he's looking huge. As you can see all the guys here, we've just had food. Big shout out to Colin and Darren from Giants Live for making this happen, being in the Royal Albert Hall. Now it's time to perform for Britain's Got Talent, let's go. Do re mi fa sol da. Jordan Mulligan is taking us out of this wee Tesla X Lamborghini edition. Not me, I need to go to my bed because I'm old. And I'm gonna get drunk. <laughs> Tom requested it, by the way. I'm not picking the music, by the way. It's He's Tom, and, it. Tom and Simon. Jerry, how's the trip, mate? Good, mate. I'm uh, getting chauffeured about by Jordan <laughs> in our Tesla. It's a fast speed Tesla, bro. We just went on a nice wee night drive on a date with uh, Luke and uh, Jordan's car that we stole off him. He's back in Nottingham now anyway. Thank you for watching. Luke, how do you feel? I feel great. Thanks for asking, Tom. <laughs> it's no um, problem at all. That's what brothers are for. Anyway, stay safe, smile and stay spicy. Keep ringing that little bell. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs>